Alex is slots 89. Um, I have this video on 1.25 uh, faster, so it's 0.25% faster than uh, normal. It's just in an effort to make my video shorter and easier watched. And I also turned the turn the brightness up just a tad. Um, let me know what you think of it. Do you like the videos a little bit darker? Or is it easier to see uh, with it being light? <clears throat> um, just in an effort to make my videos better quality. Um, anyway, what I'm trying to get into today is uh, who is Lights Out 89. I should have been doing this like the first or second video, but I didn't. Um, I am a 23-year-old Army veteran. I joined uh, I joined the Army in or I shipped off from the Army in January 2009, and I got out April 2012. And for the last year or so, year and a little bit, I've been going to college. Um, I was in the 82nd Airborne Division. I don't know if any of you have ever heard of that. Some of you possibly. Uh, it's, a, it's a parachute infantry division. I wasn't infantry, but I did jump out of planes. And if anybody, if anybody wants to hear about that, I guess uh, I could talk about it in my next video. Um... I went to Afghanistan in December 2009, and I got back September 2010, and I was scheduled to redeploy February 2012, but I was getting out of the Army, so they figured it would be a waste of money to send me for just a few months. Um, why did I get out of the Army? Uh, as a lot of people in the Army know, the 82nd is a black hole. You can't get out of it. Even though I was proud to be in the in the unit, um, I would I wanted to see new places. I wanted to experience new things in the same old, same old. You know, actually do my job. And you know, in the eighty second, you know, I didn't really have any option to go anywhere. So my only option was to get out. Um, and I figured that if I ever wanted to go back in, you know, having a college education could help me. You know, because I didn't I didn't want to be just an army grunt. You know, if, if I want to ever want to go back in the army, I can as an officer with a, just a four-year degree and um, a lot of leaders in the army just don't know what the fuck they're doing uh, the enlisted personnel could honestly be better leaders than fucking 90 percent of the officers they think they know about combat just because they have a four-year degree that's not the case but you know you can't fight the system you got to go with it if you want to be a if you want to be a good leader go ahead get your degree and you know fucking run the army like you need like you know you can and you know it should um, about the gameplay real quick, uh, 50 kills, capture your flag, league play, I was playing solo in this game, and I know the players that I was playing against were bad, obviously, um, not every league play game is like this, or else, what would be the point of playing league play, you know, you play it for competition, just like game battles, oh. <clears throat> um, speaking of game battles, I'm probably not gonna be playing that much pubs, late, or anymore, um, this game's just gotten kind of boring to me. The public side is too much bullshit, you know, having to deal with lag comp and all this other shit. So if you want to play with me still, um, league play, uh, game battles, you know, I'll be playing Modern Warfare 3 a little bit, trying to get ready for Ghost. You know, I know I sound like a nerd, but um, I'm sure that Ghost is going to be more like Modern Warfare 3 than Black Ops 2, so I'd rather get used to that. And I know, I know right here I fucking totally missed that guy while I was reloading and he, and he killed my, he killed my, uh, flag carrier. Yeah, I'm, I guess I am blind sometimes, but, um, this game, this game is really, you know, I, I love that they made it a competitive game, I love all that, they, the only issue that most people had with the game was the connection, and they, st you know, it's been out for months and months and months and they haven't even tried to fix it, or, you know, even, even, you know, they just, they sell the game, then they sell the map packs, and then they don't do anything else with it. You know, Modern Warfare 3, people had problems, you know, spawn trapping on demo, they fixed it. You know, there is no spawn trapping in demo on Modern Warfare 3 unless you got, like, a full squad, and you, you know, you nerd it out and know all the spawn points, but it's still it's still not like Black Ops 2. You know, you're not going to be able to fade around the corner and keep on killing them over and over. Um... On Ghost, I'm probably going to go back to Team Defender. I might still play Demo a little bit. Um, so, who knows? Uh, 
as most of you guys know, this is, you know, I didn't play much demolition on Modern Warfare 3. I think I had like 10,000 kills in demolition out of, you know, 150,000 that I had. And I was mostly a team defender player. It's just, it's more fun to me because I mostly play solo, like I said. Um, I don't know why the video is skipping right here. Uh, the editing software on ArcSoft, of course. Sorry about that. But it's almost over anyway. Gonna get two more kills. Um, like, subscribe, favorite if you enjoy.